Hello photographers. Today I'm going to show you how to create a contact sheet once you've downloaded your photos onto your desktop. So as I should, I have my photo and folder sitting in my desktop. Everything I need for the class is in that folder. I click on it. I see I have all the project folders. You're welcome to pause and make the project folders if you don't have them. But you should have a folder with everything you need for that project in it. I'm going to work on unusual perspectives today. So I don't have my 30 photos because this is a sample. I just have a few and then we can do things quicker. But you should have 30 photos you took outside of class on your own for the project in this folder. And we're going to make a contact sheet with those. So to do that, I click on Photoshop and I go File, Automate, Contact Sheet 2. And then I need to choose the correct folder. So I make sure it's on folder. I click Choose. And then I've done this already because, of course, I messed up the video the first time. But it's good. I can click on my desktop here, Photo 1 folder, Unusual Perspectives folder. I see my photos there. I click Open. And then I just want to confirm up here that it's the correct folder. I click OK. Everything else is the default, so that's fine. And you can see your photos loading over here in your Layers panel. So I know that they're loading and coming up. This is going to take a little bit, especially with 30 photos, so you can see them all billing in and all the thumbnails popping up. When this is done, you're going to print it. So I will go File, now this one's done, Print. And you want to print to the 057 printer. That's the one in our classroom. So that's the one we click on. It should look just like it should over here. We click Print. We click Print again because it's good to confirm things, I guess. And listen, do you hear it? It's printing. Super fabulous. And then to save it, I'm going to go File, Save As save to my computer and I want this to save. I'm going to change this to unusual perspectives contact sheet and this is, mm, is it finding my photo folder? If you've saved something to the photo folder recently it might be there for you. It doesn't appear to be there. So I'm just going to save it to the desktop and I'll move it in there in just a moment. So there we go. Look at there it is. I put it right into my unusual perspective photo. It's there. I close it up. Everything I need is tucked away. I'm good to go. That's it.